Okay, on this page, I might want to add some information about where I work. An All About Me book is a great way to share information with your students about yourself or the way you have your room set up and the way you want your students to use different parts of the room or information about your school. Your students can also create an All About Me book to share information with you about themselves. So on this page, I'm going to tap on the plus menu and the top menu bar. I'm going to jump back over to the media tab back to photos. I'm going to go back to my album that I've created and I'm going to add a couple pictures of my desk area. Again, I'm going to grab those blue handles. I'm going to make those a bit smaller, move them down a little bit. I'm going to go back and tap the plus sign again. Back to the media tab. Back to photos. Back to my album. And again, you could Use the live camera if you want to grab a live photo of something for your book. In addition to some tables, I also have a desk. So I'm going to add a photo of that. I'm going to push in on those blue handles to shrink that photo to about the same size. I'm going to adjust that a little bit more. Line it up a little bit. There we go. It's pretty good. Right, I can quickly add some text to this page. I'm going to tap on the plus sign in the top menu bar. I'm going to go back to the media tab and just add some regular text. And I'll just call this my desk area. Go ahead and tap done in the top right corner of that text box when you're finished adding the text to your page. I'm going to make that a little bit larger. Now what you'll notice is that book creator remembered the last color that I had selected for the text. On the front cover my name was in purple so it's added this text in purple. I'm going to go to the inspector button. While that is selected I'm going to make that larger and I'll, I'll just leave it in purple. Um, I could center it on the page here if I wanted. I'll tap off of that menu bar I'm going to stretch that out to make it a bit wider. Let's go ahead and try out the pen tool. So go ahead and tap on the plus sign in the top menu bar. Tap on the media tab. Go ahead and tap on the pen tool button. In your top menu bar, your the color of your ink is black to start with if you don't like that. Go ahead and tap on that inkwell and select a different color. Again, you can choose any of these 12 standard colors at the top. Or you could tap on the more button. You could drag your finger around through that spectrum of color to find the exact shade that you want and adjust the brightness and the darkness at the bottom. Tap apply when you're finished. Also in those inkwells, Book Creator again remembers your last 12 color selections at the bottom. Then just use your finger or a stylus to go ahead and draw on the page. I have a table and a desk. Being able to use the pen tool could be really handy if you're having students write in their book or annotate on top of photos or maps or do any sort of writing. You also have an eraser tool. You could use that eraser to erase your text. You could use your pencil again to replace that. You also have the undo button in the top left corner that you can step back through anything that you've added to the page. When you're finished writing on the page or annotating, go ahead and tap on the done button. And now you'll notice that your writing or that ink layer has become an object. So again, you can grab those blue handles in the corner. You could resize your ink. You can move it around on the page and adjust it to be exactly where you want it. When you're finished, tap off of that to unselect that layer. 